Get it right, moron. Wait, Doctor, what the hell is that? Doctor, I'm fine, too. Good thing. Oh. Akakuna Senshiro, Yujo des. In the... I don't know much of a role of this one, Yeah, you got knocked the hell out. That's what happened. You got so fast to the bar. Careful. You've been on a loser streak and I've uh, and definitely give it one shot. Yep. Right. Also guys, an interesting note here. Um, tonight the middleweight champion Divine Grace will be in a non-title meeting. We'll be facing Isakaz in the main event tonight. And uh, is that, is this for a title? Uh no, it's not for the it's non title. Stay heavy on the head. Okay. Uh by the way, for those new to Ring Wars, first off, welcome. Uh Ring Wars are fought under Pride Champion Pride Fighting Championship rules. 10 minute round followed by two 5 minute rounds. Attacks to the eyes, groin, and spine are prohibited, and Tyler might be in trouble here. Tyler needs to cover up, and Tyler needs to cover up and use his dad to keep him, keep him at a distance and set him up for a, a vicious shot. Yeah, his reach already been busted open within like the first 15 seconds of the fight. Hey, Ivan could catch him with a lot of counter hits. Oh, 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 my God. God. Oh, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. He didn't recover. He recovered. Nice. He's done by a title. Look at what he's like. He's in trouble. He took way too many of those hard and the haymaker go. shot. Oh, 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 God. Oh. Can he hold on? Good. He held on. Nice, nice. Yo, know, he's in trouble, man. He needs to get out of here. Remember, he Tariq has good stand up, but on the ground, he's in a bad situation. He has trouble in the ground. He is in a bad spot here. Yo, oh my god, what a hard shot. I mean, Tyler's got to get off the ground, get him back to a vertical base, and again, just attack, but keep his di like keep him at a distance. Oh, that's it. He's literally he's out. Paramedics, it is over. There's no way he's getting up from that. He's out. He's out. Victory. Fatality. That was a flawless victory. Fatality. That was a fatality. Yeah, fatality is much worse. They're harder to pull off. Look at this shot. Ooh, huh? <laughs> and then at the last two for good measure. Now the referee had to even want you to get the good off of the referee telling you how to nail those extra hits. That was quick. How long that was that? Winner! Danger! Do you think that beats the record from the time? Oh, yeah. 
next one, yeah? Three minutes, 44 seconds. We go through the uh, highlights of this match as we are, as everyone's setting up for the uh, next fight. Okay, Simon couldn't get out of the box. He was yeah, wait, look at this knock, look at this knockdown. Oh. He's a hard left and right, and that's the one that knocked him down. And he was trapped. I was saying, his problem was, Tyler, like, went from trying to wrestle with somebody who has a reach advantage on him. He should have tried to keep him at a distance, try to get inside him, and attack him like that, but he didn't. Yeah, big mistake on his part, and he was trapped in the mouth. He could not get out of it. Look at his left arm. Uh, he's right here trying to rush in. He got blocked up the break. You know what they say, a fool a fool rush in? Exactly. And he, he was definitely a fool on that one, rushing in and boom. See that hard right hook, uppercut, another left hook, I should say. Then yeah, the right hook there. Was I, I was right, what surprised me more than anything was Tariq didn't even get his guard up. I mean, I don't understand that either. I mean, when you yeah. come somebody like that. Oh, how do you not get your hand? How do you not try to go for a takedown? He just, he got hit so hard. He I could, he couldn't go for a takedown. Hell, man, he could have like countered the punch into a clinch, and that was a that was a rookie mistake on his part. I mean, that was a rookie mistake on his part. Yeah, I don't have much. I didn't see much tape on this guy, so it's kind of extra. I'm gonna be extra to see what kind of style he employs. Yeah, he was in. Uh, yeah, he was in the last cage match. This, this will be his first ring fight. Akakuna Senshiro, Yujo des. Jackson moving his way to the ring. This was a man who was actually close to beating Juan Colvin and in the first rank he force to get the win, the light heavyweight title, but he was unsuccessful. He's been up on an up and down lane lately. Yeah, definitely roller coaster type. Koreori, main event to Okonaimas. Aokona, 192 cm. 83キロ。キロビー。赤コーナー。192cm。83キロ。ザビースト。No elbows from here. No head batting. No to the groins. No grab roll. Okay? Strong on his foot, okay? Shake, okay? Same corner. Oh, John Evans knows exactly what he's getting into against the beast Earl Jackson. Ready? We'll find out. Go. Oh, it's oh, man. Oh, it oh. That was coming man, up. He was, able to take, take, uh, he was able to counter the tape now. You know, Carl Jackson has a huge advantage on the ground, and oh, God, here we go. Uh, there we go. Oh, no, oh, wait, he quickly got out of it. As you all know, you don't want Carl Jackson taking the mouth position. You know, your ass is done if, you're, if that happens. Look at him standing toe-to-toe -to -toe in the middle of the ring. I say he wants to keep that guard up. Watch out for that big shot. So you see that big shot coming, try to get under it, inside of him, and just wear him down. You have to watch out. John he has to be very careful about these heavy shots from the Beast. Be careful not to get taken to the ground. Yeah, the Beast is a very heavy-handed 
Very heavy handed hunter. Oh, oh, God, he got hit. Oh, God, knee! Tiger, knee! Oh, man, but he was a giant. He was a good game over the He was shook for a little bit, though, but the mistake there is on Jackson for not keeping the pressure on. Yeah, that was unlike. Oh, God. Oh, oh, like, oh he tried to take him down again. That's you get a, when you get a man like that, when he's shook like that, you have to stay on top of him. You let him up. That could, that, that could definitely cost you. Oh, oh my god! Oh, yeah, oh. What a kick! And Evans! Left! Left of the fight! Oh my god, I thought that was gonna be over. I'm off the fight! Man, that's hurt. Those are very heavy shots, man. Hands up, man! What a. But did you see that kick, though? That kick to knock him down was amazing. Uh oh. He might be in trouble. Oh, never mind. Man, Johnny was quickly able to get out of the mouth, and that's a good thing. He. Oh, what a kick by Jackson! Oh, man. But look at this strong defense that John Evans was able to hold. He was able to keep his defense. Evans has got a hard ass freaking head. Yeah, and he kept a strong guarding stance. He was able to save himself. That was a smart move there. You know, not many people can like get out of get out of can, can be able to hold their guard Golden when they're right. Golden kick up. Yeah. Five minutes into the round. Same time, Jackson, like the last time he rocked out, he did not press. Nope, he stepped back, which was a bad move. He kicked him, had him rock, and stepped back instead of staying on top of him. Oh, what a shot there, Evans. This man was too close to calling the other goal. That was a nice right hook, though, by, by Evans. Yeah, That's even though um, I think Jackson would probably have more of an advantage because, you know, he knocked him down, he got rocked because he, he rocked right Evans really hard earlier. Really. Yeah, but you also got to think Evans knocked Jackson down and had him mount with mounted punches, and Jackson's having to recover. Yes. <coughs> oh, now Evans with the mount. It's pretty been pretty evenly matched. Oh no, he's got the mount. There you go, nice. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Hard right hand by Jackson. But again, Jackson does not follow up. He doesn't keep pressing. Yeah, that could be a big mistake. He's like, I see Wayne right Hamburg gets that. That's the three minutes left in the round. Yeah, what a first round this has been for this contest. Oh, wait a minute, he's got the arm, he's got the arm. Demora locked in! The move that Rock Lesnar likes to spam. Uh, yeah, but he knows so that shit. That's it! He wasn't doing it properly. This is true. You gotta fight for underhook. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have to ask you, Triple H, not to do that move again. Brock Lesnar would not jump to the poor for more a lot. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, look at Evans. Knees. Oh, it's over. It's over. That's it. Again, it's That's over. It. It's over. It's over. He won with knees. Tiger, knees. Alright, so, yo, man, he didn't respect the knee. That's what happens when you don't respect it. Let's see this on the extreme knee for it was neat. Oh, boom. One to the face. Cover to the face. And that was it. You know, that's an instant decision. He was still guarding, but referee calls what it is. Yeah, I think the referee probably did the right thing. Wait, wait. I saw. I see. Look, that means actually went through his guard. Yeah. Well, let's get the official decision from the ring announcer. I'm Impressive victory here by the by the Gilla B, John Evans. Hard freaking head. Yeah, he just stung Clark Jackson. This was, as Jim Russ would call, a slobber knock. Yeah, look at that kick that knocked him down. And then this is when John Evans was literally capitalizing. Yeah, Jackson on a couple of occasions. Yeah, you saw the referee, you know, he was right there in position. He wanted to see if it was, he, he, he was just trying to see, trying to see if it was, oh, if, if, he, if the match could continue or not, but he was able to recover out of it. This is one of the mistakes. Yeah, 
I was, I was about to mention that was a couple on well, a couple of occasions was beat, but Evans was able to recover, got back in it, and I thought it was knees to the kidneys, but it was knees to the face. It looked like knees to the kidneys from a different angle, but there you go. Tiger, knees! Oh, that's right. Now we have Marco Lee leading this way tonight. Marco Lee definitely a talent when it comes to MMA. He's a man who took a horn and took to the limit. We were in the middle of a championship tournament. Yep. Yeah. Marco Lee looking to get back in the Martin Jones. Martin! <laughs> what the hell? Were you making yep. reference to that old sitcom? Yeah. Yes, I, I, was, I was about to say, you never watched that show? Yeah, I did. Oh. I was really young when that show was out. And we were all really young. I don't know, maybe I was pretty young. This is the main event. コーナー、コーナー、193キロ。レンズ。赤コーナー、193cm、83kg。ドゥーン。No elbows from here. No head butting, no to the groins, no grab roll, okay? Strong on his butt, okay? Sink, okay? Sink on. Judge, judge, judge. Ready? Hey, here we go. It's about a battle of experience here. Sign him up, sign him up. Warren Jones, old as shit, but let's see if he can do something against the young gun from South Africa. Fake him first and get those hands back. And this is probably like, yeah, you're, you, I gotta agree with you. This is definitely one of your classic battles of youth versus old. Alright, now shooting for the legs, but he blocks it. Knee! Knee to face, and he's got... Perfect work! He's got the mount position. Uh, Mario Jones quickly yes. able to get out of it. Mario Jones in, uses a wrestling, uh, amateur, has an amateur wrestling background. So, of course, he's gonna have find ways to get out of it. Stand him toe to toe. <clears throat> Trying to go for a takedown again. Lee was able to block it. Block it. And. Man, they were so god, man. They punched each other that time. Definitely don't want to try to throw the big shot too early and, like, call your shot because if they see it coming, they can find ways to move, block it, and catch you with a counter shot. I was Lee, I would try to keep Martin Jones pinned to the ropes or to the corner. Right, he's going now. Trying to pin him, trying to find, try to transition into a good, into like a clinch position or something like that and deliver punches or knees. Or, you know, try to, you know, trap him in the corner of the ropes and then try to take him down to the mat. Right now these guys are literally trapped in a clinch fight. Yeah, I don't think this is probably too happy with that. No, not at all. They want, wait, to see some, like, they want to see some fight. Here we go. Some break. Yeah, we know it's hard to get position. You know, in MMA, even in professional wrestling, or in even MMA, trend, 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 position and spacing play key factors in matches. Right. He's countering you. Don't chase him. You know, remember, this ain't no octagon. This is a ring. You have plenty of space nice to move around. Right. Just remember that the corners and the ropes are your dead ends. And unlike in wrestling, there's no, there's no rope breaks. 
Right. A lot fewer dead. A lot. A lot fewer dead ends in a in a traditional race than in a knockout. Five minutes. Right, we have to separate them. See. Or freeze it. Oh, see that they're doing it again. They're clinching again. Clinch, clinch, clinch. Clinch fight. Bro, go. Oh, tried over a kick. Martin Jones able to block it. Trying to take him out again. Martin Jones, he's trying to he, he's trying to take Mark Lee down, but oh, but it's not going going in his favor. And look at Lee with these knees. Control his hands. Tiger. Knee. You gotta fight for under him. Now, now Martin Jones. Now the advantage position. Nice. Now he's got the more advantageous position. Punch his face. Got to punch in the head, head. over the mouth. Trying hard. to wear down Lee. Take your time, walk your knees See, up. Lee got a butterfly guard up. He's got two knees to the ribs, able to get out of it, able to get himself off, That's get Martin Jones back off it. Again, they go to the clinch. No more chicken stop him! No more chicken stop him! I would have to say, this, if by the time this match ends, this probably will be tied up. Leah, what do you think? Uh, I, I thought there was a joke. I, 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 I was wondering if there was a joke in this. Don't forget to take the uh, No, I was actually being pretty serious. About who do you think would probably uh, win this round? <laughs> yeah, because yeah, they, yeah, they, they actually spent this round tied up. Yeah. <laughs> Much of it's uh, tied up anyway. Well, they have been treating blows, though. Yeah, but they were mostly clipped. Oh, he rocked it. Oh, what a oh, shot. Oh, there he goes. Oh, goes Lee. Can Lee recover? Can Lee recover? It's over. Good night, man. Good night, man. Good night, man. Good night, man. Experience beat this. How about that one? The older talent chop up the younger talent. There is no such thing as jobbing in MMA. Unfortunately. Let's see that again. That was what did it in. Referee was like, get off him. Yeah, he knew he was uh, so Let's see this again on the replay that he can't move. Man. Incredible. He did it night night. Let's get the official one. I'm not even going to see it. Show show. for that one shot, that one shot count. The old dad beat the young lion. I have a feeling that somewhere this is this would kind of be like that awkward moment from in Rocky, in one of the Rocky movies. I actually was watching Rocky Five the other day. Uh, I was actually referring to Rocky Three, which was you know the youth versus the old. Rocky Three. No, Rocky Three was. Wait, no, Rocky Three was when he fought Mr. C. Yeah, that's what I'm referring to. That was Oh. Uh, you know, Mr. C was supposed to be it was the young gun, and Rocky was the old. Was the old. Yeah, no, they more focused that on that in Rocky Five when they had Tommy Morrison being the young gun that Rocky met for, and they had the street fight. We love street fights. Indeed. Eddie, do you love street fights? Well, street fight. Oh, street fight. See right here. You can see what that. It wasn't. This wasn't much of a street fight, but Martin Jones. As, as, as you know, as MMA fights go, one good shot. Yeah, we saw the example of that with Quan Coleman and Margot Lee in the in the middleweight tournament. Right. And Quan Coleman came out of nowhere with the one shot that knocked him out. This is a piece of self here. How ironic. Yeah, as soon as he got him out, smart move. He knew he had him down in rock. He stayed on top of him. And that's how you win fights. And I'm ready. Ready to win your two main event. And now, the Brad Middleweight. Here goes the man who's possibly a contender 
for a kick towards the heavyweight championship, Kenji Sasaki. You guys remember, he's the dude who beats Rick Tyner not once, but twice. Yep. And Tyler is far Tyler going to lose for just to play tonight. On Asian violence. You have China versus Japan. Who knew? I go with a four inch height advantage over Suzaki. Don't chase him! Yeah, but even though Daigo is mainly a submission specialist, the man can fight like any other. Right. So, so in PWS, he has a habit of trolling people with judo throws. <laughs> and the constant arm bars. <laughs> that, that, that goes the type of guy, if you he, if he, if he stick a limb out, if you give him an opportunity, he's going to slap a submission on you, he's going to slap a submission on you, and he's going to snap a ball, and you're going to have to tap out. Right. If you remember, he was taken down in 15 seconds by Divine Grace. If you remember, in the middleweight tournament. Make him first get those hands back. Divine Grace is on a whole other plan right now. Yeah, man, he's a triple crown he champion. Keep going to the right. Legs. See, Daigo, stick it right. Definitely can strike and move. That's what he's got to do, strike and move and look for an Stand opening. Up. Grab a limb and slap something on somebody on this guy and really torture him. Yeah, so far, you see uh, Kenji having a really, giving us really strong uh, stand-up game. Over He's not going to be taking any unnecessary chances because his chance is trying to go for clinches because he knows that if Daigo grabs a limb while in the clinch, he's done. Right. So right now, they're starting off right now, they're just starting off the strike. I believe kick. Kenji might want to keep it that way. Right. Yeah, Kenji tries to get into a clinch game or even a ground game with Daigo, he's in trouble. No, nothing nothing good can happen to Suzaki if it goes to the ground. Yeah, Please. remember what happened to me. Right. Even though, <laughs> even though I did get even with him in, that, in the in the rematch, that time my arm was healthy. You job, like you job to the arm bar. <laughs> you know I wasn't hundred percent. I won the Inside rematch. To the, the arm bar you out, son. Yeah, even though I won the rematch. The arm bar you out, son. Yeah, even though I won the rematch. I go. Like I said, he's just... Triple H won the rematch too, but that's a change the fact that the first time Triple H arm bar got arm bar that. Go ahead, kick up. Go ahead, kick up. Five minutes into the round. They're, they're pretty even. They haven't really done it. Oh man! Grab his leg. Oh! 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 I was crazy. Shit, this is the man who. This is the man who beat half the PWS roster until he fought the kid in the in the World Heavyweight Championship tournament. Oh! Oh, but I. Oh, 
Oh. Can Daigo recover? Can Daigo hold on? Can Daigo hold on? Oh my god, he held it. You see those knees? Jesus. He's got it. Can't you fall out of here? No one's gonna stop him! No one's gonna stop him! Three minutes left in the round. Daigo still keeping a strong yep. guarding position here. Oh, wait, uh oh. He's turned the tables at the That's moment. Now, darkness, tables are turned. Yes! Now, the hard part is gonna. Getting the mount, getting getting your opponent on the ground is one thing. The hard part in MMA, it's a universal problem, is trying to keep that position. Yeah. Beautiful. And you see Daigo, no matter what part of the mount he's in, whether he's dominant or not, he can find a way to put a submission hold on Suzaki. Knees. Heads up, team now. Knees ahead. Control his hands. Need ahead. Oh, up in the back vertical. There it is. Punch and then move. No good to go eat boom. No good to go eat boom. One minute left in the round. Oh, man, what a oh. shot. Punch. See if you can get this round in the back. Look at this. Oh, man. Yeah, he got nothing. Fuck out, man! He's really out, too. Look at that shot! Look, he's, you saw how hard that punch was? Oh, he hit him so hard. He was, he was out before he even hit the ground. Oh, look how he fell. Eddie, look how Dago fell. Yeah, he got that shit, man. He got out before he hit the ground. He dropped dead. Boom. And then he's out before he even hit the ground. Yeah, I did. I did. I did. I did. I That was a pump. I don't know what that was. They both hit. He was out before he even hit the freaking ground. Let's see this on the highlights. I mean, Daigo lasted pretty long. He, he, it only get held on for a little bit longer before for the first round to end. I mean, look at these shots by, by Kenji. The uh, Kimura attempt. That's when Kenji got knocked down. Alright, and I believe here is that shot. Let's see that again. He added one more punch to good, uh, one more punch to good measure. Right. Oh god, I wonder what else could happen tonight. These some very hard shots. I really think Suzaki, if like, not for the knockout, would at least won this round. But he definitely was putting in some shots on, da on Daigo. Right. Yeah, I honestly thought when Daigo had that Kamura on, I honestly thought the match was going to end. Rocking with that overhand right, but again doesn't doesn't rush in because the fact that he was still hey. there it is right there. Yes, hands, yes, hands down. Yeah, and that was that one was right below the chin. And now for the prize. Let's see who is going to be the winner of this main event.
Here comes Isaac Haas, the Greco-Roman wrestler from Greece. Big opportunity for Ice. Again, he's divine this non-title match. You would have to think that was one of them right before in the line for the shot of the ring was been away time. Yeah. Here comes the man. The Ring War, the man is the PWF World Heavyweight Champion, the Ring Wars Middleweight Champion, and the Cage Wars Light Heavyweight Champion, Triple Crown Champion, Divine Grace, only 19 years old from the United States. The man, the myth, the legend. The king of the hill. This is the main event. Red corner, 195cm, 83kg, the Uruk! No elbows from here. No head button. No to the groins. No grab rope. Okay? Strong on his foot. Okay? Sick. Okay? Sink on. Alright guys, here we go. Main event is on. Ice was fired the hell up. You might want to rein it in just a bit. Yeah, but Eddie, if you remember, Ice was going to be KO Smokey in 30 seconds. He's countering you. Don't chase him. Divine Grace tapped out the kid. Not once, but twice. Well, well not, 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 not so much as uh, tapped him out as... Both of the match were control. stopped by the referee. Yeah. Yeah, the referee saw that the kid was unable to continue, and I believe he did the right Inside thing. To the He's kid being dethroned, Please. led to divine grace. Be being the triple, becoming the triple crown champion. He's had one. He's had a, one, two success, one successful title defense. Against the kid with the with the PWS world title. Now you gotta wonder who will be the defending the, either the, the who will be defending the middleweight title. Against. And like you said, champ, if Ice can get a win off here, it could possibly put him on in put him probably in the number two or number three spot. Nice, nice. Well, it was mostly Eddie that said that. I just co-signed, but yeah, that's basically what we have here. Is that Ice could definitely put himself in line to shine that world middleweight title with a victory. Yeah, I know that Kenji's definitely in the line as well. Yep. If you had to argue, you know, probably Ayas and Kenji will probably be fighting in the next uh, Ring Wars for a shot at the Light Heavyweight Championship. I mean, middleweight, middleweight. Excuse me. We don't have a we don't have a contender yet for the net for for the light for 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 the Light Heavyweight Division in Cage Wars. Yet. Yeah, and right now Ayas perhaps doing the smart thing. He's clenching. Yeah, remember, you know, Greco Roman. Right. Right up again. And the Viking Grace is taking him down. Oh. Watch for him to grab your legs. Let's go. Push him up. Get your feet on the edge. Beautiful. So, you know, I remember way back, um, Ias had like this one thing. He was like a pure Greco-Roman grappler, so he never really Watch used strikes. But I guess I had to throw a heart to heart with the, the trainer, gave him a heart to heart, and said, you know, you need that. You, you've got to have strikes. Thank you for looking for that right hand. Right. Watch and then move. Because, you know, like one of the old fundamentals yeah. of Greco-Roman wrestling was you could not strike. Well, mix it up, mix it up with your punch. Nah, I mean, right here, Oz definitely got to do with, with, with you know, with bringing him to the dance. And, you know, do, use his record Roman style, but don't get too punched up because one thing about Divine Grace is he can't grab a limb and tap you out. Yeah, we saw him do that to Quan Coleman three times. The thing that has impressed me about Divine Grace is he is able to adapt. Way to work. And he, oh, man. He's already busted ice so open. I mean, well, I mean, Divine Grace is just, you know, you're right. He has, he's able to adapt, and he can just 
use any style he can to win a, uh, to win a fight. And he's shown nice. that for him being such a young kid. Not nice, even old enough nice. to drink yet, but he's just so skilled in the, in the ring, whether it's in the Make cage or in the ring I'm pretty sure people find him here. And the fight breaks down to go for blocks. Oh, this is the move he used on Crawford. Oh, he's got a good move. 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 He wasn't gonna go, he wasn't gonna fall victim to that. He's dying, keep him working. Punch his face. See, uh, Divine has like a nasty cut right there on the eye. Right eye. Now was the on the right side. Yeah, you see, eye is bleeding as well. You see, Grace is also bleeding from his nose. His nose could be pretty, could be broken. That, yeah, that would suck. Yeah, that would make breathing a lot harder because they have to breathe through his mouth. That could really cause fatigue. Yeah, it's a good, it's a good thing that you know ring wars and cage wars don't really happen as often. So that gives you know some of these guys Hands time up. to heal. Hands up. Right. You know, you know, we're not like UFC that has like show Watch fight night shows every you. week, not giving anybody time to heal, and then they, and then the Hands whole three strike reduce thing, 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 which if you lose three times, you're out of UFC. One cool. minute left in the round. Five seconds. Grace on the top now. That's it. Big shot by Ice. Thirty seconds back. left. Can Divine hold up? Perfect. I know. I got this round in, in favor of Divine. Uh, Champ, what do you think? I think it's a little close, but I think Divine may have it a little. May have it just barely. All right, we have a match. The round's over. Both men are in the first time tonight. We go to a second round. Yeah, the first time the whole night. Co-made event was actually close to going to a second round. Take him down. You're gonna impose your will. You're a bigger, stronger guy. All right. Get him down. Guy closer than he's been the last two fights. Finally, we hit a second. Right. You still holding that guard? Then you have that combat. You take yourself. Okay. All right. Let's go through the highlights of the first round. Let's do a recap here. See Divine Grace. Definitely good at striking, but you see right here, left himself wide open. Four, nice shot to the left on the, on the left side. And there was that uh, tr the, uh, triangle from earlier. Eyes do exactly the Divine Grace is deadly with that arm with that triangle. And now Champ loses his skin shit, man. Goddamn right shit. God damn. Seconds out, guys. Seconds out. Let's see. Right. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, <laughs> Alright, now we're down to with five minutes now of the second round. Alright, five minute rounds in the second and third round in Ring Wars. And if it goes the distance, it'll go to the judges' scorecard. He's looking for the kick! Hey, right, these guys standing. literally like all over. Clint Divine. Oh, takedown by by us. There we go. Divine Grace better be Hands careful up. here in the clinch. Yes. Yeah, but Divine Grace from that position. Oh, what a head stun! Wow, man. Perfect work. And, you know, in that be position, Divine here. Grace can use the. Uh, Keep it down. There you go, nice. The uh, go go plata here. He's trying to. He's trying to hold down the leg of Ice. He's trying to prevent Ice from getting into a more dominant position. You see him trying to wrap his leg around his, but he was unable to this time. Yep. No more chicken soup. No more chicken soup. Three minutes nice, left nice. in the round. He's trying to. He's almost got it locked in. You see, Divine Grace trying to put it on, but he wasn't able to. Here, watch the triangle now. There it is. Stick the leg now. Now he's got Ice. has got him. Divine Grace now trapped in the corner now. Now in Grace is in a very interesting position here. He hasn't been tested in quite some time. He's always been able to get that quick victory, whether it's in ring wars or in cage wars or in PWS. He's always been able to get that quick or that sudden victory. Now he has to hang around. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting to see what kind of stamina he has on the ground. It's gonna be interesting to see what kind of stamina he has on the Oh, look at the switch! Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, Oh, and it's over. Stop. Second okay. round in. Oh, that went down. That went by quick. I think Devon's won this fight. I think Oz needs to knock Devon Grace out in order to win now. Or make him tap out. Yeah, that's definitely going to be uh, the only way Ice is going to get out of this. Out of this situation. Yeah, I mean, Devon Grace really pulled that out of nowhere. But that was a... Look at that cut on Devon Grace's eye. Yeah, they're both hurting right now. Take out some of the highlights. I mean, Divine Grace is proving a lot to me in this match right now. He's really right showing something. He looks like Divine Grace can really can go to distance. You know, Brunson does a round three. He right there tried to go for an arm bar from lying down. as a global plata. I was able to hold on from it, but man, like I said, that man definitely good when it comes to submissions, but he can adapt to other styles as well. That was showing Rick being a veteran in that ring, only being 19. It's Oh dear, six pound eight out of eight. Seconds out of eight. Well, here we go, final round. Right, here we go. Divine Grace is really in, has been really been impressing me. I gotta say, this man, I get you can say that he's yeah. well tested in the distance right now. Yeah, well, let's see how he can do with five more minutes in the third round. Yeah, see, I is trying to be, trying to be more aggressive. This is the longest. I believe this is the longest. The Divine Grace is going to a fight since the tournament. Oh, yeah. Because then, you know, if you... Oh, 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 wait, hammer this. Oh, no. Oh, I mean, quiet. Quiet, please. Is she doing it? Yeah, what's this? Yeah. Another thing. So, look at that. Oh, 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 Ready and a big that? opportunity for Ice. Trying to bend the joint in that elbow. Trying to bend it in a somewhat uncomfortable position. And Ice sprays himself. Man, okay. Champ no match no 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 four started this round. Ice might need a knockout to win this thing. A knockout or a knockout TKO submission. He's got him again. Well, Grace Grace survives again. He's going to try it again. Man. Damn it, Ice was able to free himself. Man. Ice was well prepared for this match. He did his homework. Beautiful. Yeah, but Grace is definitely showing that, that he has control. the stamina to last a, a full match. Hands up. Hands up. He's in trouble now. I'm sure championship matches probably go longer than three rounds, though. Watch for him to grab your leg! Uh, to be careful because I, he, I, if you notice, Ice is making Divine Grace baby. move himself into the corner. It's what? A, it's a, what an upset! You felt that Ice is trapped. And if you didn't notice, Ice was making Divine Grace move himself back and he moved himself right into the corner. Yeah, he had nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. Yeah, look, look, right there. He made him drag himself through the corner. He had nowhere to move after that. <laughs> See this again. He was making him, he was making the Divine Grace drag himself into the corner. And look at these hammer fist shots. <laughs> you want to go night night? You want to go night night? Okay, let's push it Ice could possibly be the next contender for the Little League Championship. I don't see how he's not. But then you have Sasaki, who's also in, the, in line for the champ for the championship. But I just beat the champ. He just beat him. Yeah, I think we. I think we know we're getting a shot there. Well, we don't know who's getting a shot, but somebody's got to know. I was, 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 I was
go through the highlights of this match. This is a, this is an impressive performance by Ice. Yeah, he was able to. I've got nothing to be ashamed of. And he lured, just, he lured Divine Grace into the corner. I just had the, had the perfect game plan, and he worked it. Yeah, and look, you see Divine Grace, he was actually moving backwards. And I is basically changing his direction, moving him into the corner. You saw that when, by the time his, the Divine Grace's head reached the turnbuckle, that was his chance. That's it for Ring Wars. We'll see y'all later. Hello.